And now, Storm Tracker Weather with meteorologist Eric Ash. Starting with the winds, we'll be windy today just like yesterday and we'll be windy into the evening time as well. 8 to 30 miles per hour is what we're expecting. Now temperatures are now below average for this time of year due to this cold front that's affecting us right now today, this morning, today. That's bringing a lot of cold air behind it. So for high temperatures, Pocatello will get up to 51, Idaho Falls 49 and we're expecting snow showers throughout the day especially during the routine work hour. Southeast Highlands will get into the 40s. We do have low 50s for Preston and Downey. For the Central Mountains, temperatures will be in the 40s as well. And for the Eastern Highlands, temperatures will be in the 30s with 41 for Island Park and 28 for Yellowstone. Now, if you are above 7,000 feet, anticipate three to five inches of snow. If you're below 7,000 feet, then anticipate one to three inches of snow. Into the evening time, Snake River Plain getting below freezing. We are now below freezing once again. Pocatello 29, Idaho Falls 26 degrees. For the Southeast Highlands, temperatures will be in the 20s as well. And for the Central Mountains in the 20s, Ledor and Stanley into the teens. Stanley getting down as low as 11 degrees. Eastern Highlands, temperatures in the teens with Yellowstone a single digit at five, five degrees. So young livestock and new Newly planted uh, vegetation, flowers, herbs. Definitely be careful, especially if you went out and started planting for the spring season. It's a little early. We are expecting some below freezing temperatures tonight. Tomorrow for the Snake River Plain, Pocatello will get up to 54. Idaho Falls will get up to 52. Southeast Highlands temperatures, 40s and 50s. And for the Central Mountains, we've got 40s and 50s as well. 50 degrees for salmon and chalice. For for the Eastern Highlands, temperatures will be in the 30s and 40 degrees. For Driggs and Afton, 43 for Island Park. Partly cloudy skies and a downward trend in strength of wind speed. Now let's take a look at the Southeast Idaho Chevy dealer seven day forecast. Pocatello, 51 degrees. We've been bumped down with our temperature, but we'll get back up into the 60s for the weekend, mid to upper 60s for the weekend. For Blackfoot, today a high temperature of 48. Then we get to 51 tomorrow and then reaching into the mid 60s for the weekend as well. Mostly sun. High pressure expected to start building tomorrow slash into Friday. And that will be the reason for our warming trend back into the 60s. We do touch 71 degrees on Tuesday far out in advance. But there it is 71 on Tuesday for Idaho Falls for the Central Mountains. 44 degrees today, 47 tomorrow, touching the low 60s for the weekend for the weekend for the Teton area today 39 degrees tomorrow 40 and then an upward trend a warming trend into the mid 50s by the end of the forecast period starting with the weekend so snow showers today cold front moving out today and then high pressure building for the rest of the week giving us a warming trend back to you Deanne.